Welcome back. This is week 33, version 0.45. As usual, update for this week, new stage. This is another stage by Jason Bird from the Tasmanian State Titles. This is stage 12. A few enhancements as well, so let's go take a look at this stage first. So here you go. This is Jason's stage. Pretty interesting stage. You see lots of targets down range. And then there are two doors on the left and on the right. And you can start position is starting anywhere within the shooting area and shoot them as you see them. Pretty cool stage. What do you see here? We have bobbers, we have swingers, and these are all activated by the doors. So the procedure would probably be somewhere around here, standing here. You draw, you shoot this one, you shoot that paper over there as well. Head up to the door, you open the door, and, you and then you, you're able to see that popper which activates this bobber, that popper activates the swinger. So you shoot those two here and then get those targets, shoot that steel plate, run across to this side, shoot this one, and shoot that paper, and come up to this door, open it, hit that bobber, hit that uh, popper which will activate this swinger and that plate. So relatively straightforward, um, I'm going to use waypoints, right? So I'll start here, shoot this, shoot that, move up here, set the first waypoint, and then I want to teleport over here instead of running over. Shoot this one, that one, so set the next waypoint here, and then the last waypoint here. Okay, so let's try that. Make ready? No. Are you ready? Mm hmm. Stand by. Uh. Oh, first waypoint, front door. Bobber. Singer. Oh, forgot to use single stack. Reload. Reload as well. Oh, hopefully I got everything. If you're finished, oh, no. unload and show clear. If no, clear, hammer down and holster. Dang it. Oh, and yeah. Anyway, the other thing I forgot I forgot to hit that plate. So anyway, the other thing I fixed is the the recording feature used to blink the screen when you end the stage when you holster uh, and when it saves the recording for your play, it sort of pauses the game a little bit and it blinks so it makes the experience really bad. So I fixed that and now when you holster, range is clear. There's no blinking that happens anymore. As you can see, I forgot to engage that, and that's why I got two procedures. One for the mic, and one for not even engaging that plate. So there you go, pretty fun stage. And Jason's stages are pretty fun, just like Brand's stages as well. There are a lot of options here, you can run back and forth, you can go from left to right, and so forth. So that's the enhancement for this week, and the saving enhancements was pretty cool too. I was really excited that I managed to get that done. It's been on my backlog for such a long time. Now one more last thing, I got a new prop. Okay. Okay, the new prop is called a rocker. Uh, if you see it, it's actually behind those two barrels. So what basically it does is you know, there's a target in the middle and there is a rocker bar with two steel plates on a hinge. And then there are two weights here as well. So what happens is you start off by shooting either left or right plate and that will destabilize the whole contraption. So when you hit it, when, let's say for instance, if you hit this plate, then that side is heavier. So as it tilts, the weight will pop out and once so once it tilts a little bit when the weight pops out and this side is heavier because there's a weight over here then what happens is it will rock back onto the right side so if you shoot this plate it rocks over there and then this side is heavier now it will rock back this way and then if you don't shoot it then this plate hides behind the obstacle so you got to get plate plate or plate paper plate depending on how you want to do this so let's go back to here and let's try that so let's reset Okay, I'm just going to shoot the right side. You can see it pops up from that side. Those two. And then shoot that or you can shoot it here. So it's a simple prop that's obscured. You can shoot and you can have this in your stage now. So this prop is also now available in the stage designer. For all guys who want to build their own stages. Let's try it. Let's shoot it one more time. Let's try shooting on the left side instead. And then get the paper. Oh, pull a reload. Let's see before it goes away. Yeah, something like that. 
Let's head back to the main menu. Okay. Those are the visible updates for this week. I hope you guys like the new prop and the new stage. There's been a lot of internal fixes that I've done with some of the stages and how I or how stage designers create the stages. So I had to go through almost every single stage that was done in the past to make sure that fits the new system. So that took quite a lot of work as well. So that's it for this week. I hope to uh, focus on a tutorial. Actually, a lot of users have been telling me that I need to enhance my tutorials because it's there should be two tutorials. One, how to play the game, how to use the controls, and the other is actually about Ipsic and USPSA. So I'll make those tutorials hopefully next week or in the next two weeks, and I hope the new players will like it. Till then, see you next week. Bye.